Hey guys, so today I want to check out some gaming here on the new Galaxy S4 active smartphone which is like a Galaxy S4 but uh, it's waterproof and dustproof. Now the gaming experience should be about the same as you would get on the S4 but you never know until you really try it in real life. So that's why I'm gonna try it out a little bit here. So I'll be trying out some other games as well. And also you might see that the display, uh, it's not a normal AMOLED display that you would get on the S4, it is the uh, a TFT display, which is actually very very bright here, which I do enjoy, uh, especially in this game. Uh, a AMOLED display could be very very bright pretty quick. So you can see here, that it seems like we have some very very good performance here. And I mean, it is a quad-core uh, quad core processor, so you shouldn't really have any major issues with gaming. And this phone is also, it's a very, very good alternative if you want to have a phone that is... You want to have a phone that's waterproof. <laughs> but still doesn't have a horrible uh, viewing angle. So of course, the viewing angle is not, of course, as good as the S4, but almost. Almost as good. And you can see here the performance. It could actually be a little bit better than the S4, I'm not quite sure how that could be the case. Maybe it could be that Rockstar have updated their game to be better now on the Adreno 320 GPU. And I'm pretty sure that you do get on the S4 Active. We have the quad core 1.9 GHz clock processor. Uh, and also, pretty interesting here is that. If this phone gets super warm, just because it's waterproof, you can't you just dip it in water or something, I'm pretty sure. And then it will get cold again, which is very, very nice. So I'm not really sure if the device is going to get super warm when you have played uh, a lot of games on it. I suppose that that's a thing that uh, we just have to find out eventually. Uh, we will notice something. Let's see if we can drive down here. I'm not sure if I can crash this vehicle. There should be some kind of option to do that. Uh, I, I do really do want to know how the display uh, is in daylight conditions. Let's see here. Drive down the bike. Now we'll be waking up at the hospital. I can feel the device is getting a little bit warm here also, same as the S4. So you can see that the TFT display is handling uh, day daytime very, very good. Very, very bright display here. Do I have some lag issues over here? Let's grab this vehicle. It's my friends. <laughs> I just didn't drive over that person, no. Seems like the game actually did perform a little bit better uh, in nighttime than what it's doing here in daytime. Maybe because it has to render more things, because you see more stuff. That could be one of the reasons why. But overall, no major issues with this game. Oh no, and it shouldn't of course, uh, when you're thinking that this is a high-end smartphone. You don't want to get problems or issues or anything. Driving around, driving, 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 and driving and driving. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, no, no. <laughs> 
So here's a quick little look here at GTA Vice City on the active uh, phone. If you have another game you want me to check out, please let me know about that. And I will definitely see what I can do. Have a good day.